This video will demonstrate importing a Red Hat Virtualization Virtual Machine to OpenShift Virtualization. The virtual machine to be imported is a Windows Server 2012 R2 VM, which can be seen as powered on here. Viewing the console, it is a standard VM, and we can see the modest resource requirements of one CPU and 512 megabytes of RAM. Moving to the OpenShift Virtualization Interface, we will create a new VM by importing using the wizard. Choosing Red Hat Virtualization as the provider, the interface then offers a choice of which Rev Manager instance to connect to. The import wizard collects information about the target Rev instance to populate the additional menu items. Here we will select the cluster and then the virtual machine inside of that cluster to import before moving to the next screen. The virtual machine's current configuration has been retrieved and will be used for the new VM, including the CPU and RAM allocations. If needed, the network and storage configuration for the imported virtual machine can be modified to provide connectivity and performance in line with the source infrastructure. After starting the import, the virtual machine has been defined and the disk is now being imported from the Red Hat Virtualization Storage Domain to a newly created persistent volume claim. The virtual machine has been powered off on the source rev cluster prior to beginning the import. Detailed status of the disk import is available by viewing the logs for the importer pod. This process will take a few minutes depending on the size of the disk and the speed of the storage and network, so we will skip ahead. The status has changed from importing to off, indicating that it has finished. Since we checked the box to automatically power on after import, the virtual machine is started for us and after a moment we can see which node it was scheduled to along with the IP address. After finishing the boot process, the console for the Windows Server operating system shows that it has successfully returned to operation with only a few minutes of downtime. Thank you for watching this demonstration of importing virtual machines from Red Hat Virtualization to OpenShift Virtualization. For more information, please visit openshift.com virtualization.